go see if we can tow a boat out my field. I only had a sort of epiphany that I could take that out to sea and use it for a bit of diving. I've been sitting in the field for quite a while. I'm going to stick it on the tow bar, see if I can pull it out and um, start making some plans. I didn't, sorry, I, I didn't, I didn't expect that to be like that. Sorry so much, sorry, sorry, sorry. My graveyard of things. Trailer needs a lot of work. That, a lot of water maybe caught in the back. Let's have a look. There's a bung. Oh, you got a bung on there. Got a bit of space there. A couple of days work, I'll get it up and running. A lot of water in there, but maybe I'll try and get it. Try and get it down. I hit it hard. That way. Oh. I hit mid on that. Fucking hell. What happened? Oh. My head hurts. Can you stand on it? Can we get it down? Oh shit. I've got a lump massive on my head. That's for me for wrecking Paul's camera. Face your fears. Return to the scene. Look, woo -hoo. First thing I'll do is get a better build. I tried the old siphoning hose tool, but hose is too long and oh, I wasn't sucking this water out. Blue right in front and I'll blast. Oh. I did just <laughs> Oh, what a day. It's so, 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 look, you got in my boot there. Oh. Oh, I'm just tired, so tired. You're gonna have to go and try this. Oh. Just don't Oh, fuck you. There's your bung, Dan. Oh, and did I get that bump? Did you take it out? No. Just where it's stuck. Bash, Steve. But we're going to get it out and we ain't going to stop till we're done. We're going to get defeated. Just because we've got a rain at you. Diving Saturday, I went Paintball Sunday and I was exhausted. I can hardly use my legs. My legs, I was like action man. I was tapping people out. They said I was an animal, the lifeguards. They said, never seen anything like it. They did say that. And so today I'm so exhausted and I'm determined to go shipwrecking and I need a boat. And I ain't got spare cash at me to go buy a nice boat. So I'll just go find one out in the field. But when I bashed my head, I thought, I don't want to be useless. I've got to get stuff done. I've got to make actions, movements, progression. 
Then bother piss around with the tyres because they're fat. Yeah. So I might have chewed them up, ruined them all, but they're knackered old tyres. As long as I can get here to the. So I just want Ollie to uh, put you like some uh, guns and make you look like. In post, we'll just do a paintball, Rambo. Ah. Yeah. yeah. Explosion. Uh, well, you always say do it in post. You do it in post, yeah. And it's like, that's always the really hard bit. That's you. I know, yeah. I'm not going to use this hole. Oh, you, got, you know someone who can make you one of them? Yeah, he probably made this one. <laughs> no, the stitching's too straight. Yeah. Wallop. Wallop, that's a good, that's a good boat name. Wallop on the water. Wallop's good. Please don't go the mud. The biggest thing I want to do with this, right, apart from cosmetically, is have some sort of winch so that I can chuck my gear in, my bowl, get my gear on in the water, but climb, when I'm finished the dive, I'll climb in on the ladder, but I'll leave my gear in the water, and then I can just use the winch and I can just winch my gear in. It'll be very heavy getting it in and out of the boat. Stick. Comment on your arachnophobia, really? What? Just don't think about it. Some good unused stuff in here, actually. How boring. All right, you coming up? Right, well. That would have been handy. We'll have a little bit of lunch and then we'll come do some tidying up, yeah? Yeah? Good job, thanks for your help. Thanks for your help. Thanks for your help, you're good girl. Is that the cassette that's in it? Yeah. So that's not mine? Even though Dirty Dancing is a brilliant film and it's a brilliant soundtrack and every man should be ashamed to listen to it or watch it. I grew up watching that movie when I was little. Brilliant film. What is it we have here that you can see? A bloody nice sofa, a corner sofa. Where has it come from? It come from a movie prop storage that was once held in Milan. And it was transported to England. Uh, antique dealer I know bought, bought it, got hold of it. He was told that it was an unused prop from the Scarface movie. That's what he was told, that's what he's told me. I haven't yet done the research to prove it, but it's an original 1980s sofa, which is in pristine condition. It's a unique, unique bespoke made sofa. So what, um, so what I'll say is, with it being iconic of the 80s and quite unique, I would truly believe this is a museum piece. It's so bloody cool. I had you went out for the night and you and you pulled and you. You went home and you went, oh yeah, just sit, sit on the sofa, I'll grab a drink. You whack this on, you sit down and you go, oh, I'll just uh, we'll listen to some music, shall we? Whack that on. And then, um, what's, what's the on? What's the right edge we okay, go? second from the right. No, from the, yeah, that one. Whoever you invite home wouldn't know what's hit them. They're sitting down on this sofa, the old dirty dancing blaring. The 
sofa predates Dirty Dancing, is my honest opinion. But uh, what's the time? I've got to do the school run in a minute. I've got three minutes. Hopefully, Ollie, you get this light shimmering off here. Look, really nice, really comfortable. You can, I didn't got Terry's comfortable, you can see it. Nice cushioned, got nice lumber there on the back. Oh, I love it. This could go in one's bedroom. I would like it in my bedroom. It's bloody cool, isn't it? Hey? Oli, you like it? I love it, actually, yeah. Yeah, I fell in love with it the moment I see it. The moment I see it, it's one of the purchases. As soon as I see it, I wanted it, I was in love with it, and I was, um, I still am. Beautiful so far. Uh, how are we going to sell it? We are going to maybe list it on the website for a fixed price. Should really go in a specialist auction and uh, be demanded and fought for by a few people. Truly think that is the way forward. Do the photos of it, Ollie. I don't know where we'll list it. We might need a. We might to get. We've got to get the bucks. We've got to get the money. We've got bills to pay, business to run, staff, wages, overheads. We have to get the most amount that we think a sofa or an object is worth. Yeah, the most value we can get. If it's worth less than we paid, we sell it for what the value is. But at the moment, I value this as top dollar. Quite special money, you know, like something that could make craze in an auction. That's what I think. I, um, I'd love to know what this pattern is called. Can you screenshot it and do some... Like, it's got a name for this, Ollie? Yeah, I can screen... I to can... me, it looks like little... Um, Cool. What's that game? Space Invaders. I really like Space Invaders. Right, as I said it, brilliant, incredible so far. Oh, I love it. It's awesome. Hope you enjoy it and love it. If you want to buy it, you're going to have to fight and reach out and say, I want it, I want it. How much do you want for it? I'll give you this much for it. you got to work hard to get stuff. I have to do that when I want stuff. How often do I go to places where nothing's for sale? You know, I have to work hard to buy things. I have to work hard to sell things. Anyway, got to go. Take it easy. Enjoy the vlog. Oh, it's bright out here.